y'all hate. You like my finger? <laughs> I'm just. Hey y'all, hey. If you're new here, my name is Janelle. I have a successful uh, small business. I can't even say a successful Etsy shop anymore because I've branched out beyond Etsy and it has been working in my favor on TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, um, Pinterest. Pinterest. So far, so good. I just want to answer some questions that I've been getting in my inbox on Facebook and on Instagram and on TikTok um, about the buy machine. One of the first questions is, am I sponsored? No, I'm not sponsored. I do not have a sponsorship from buy. They don't pay me for my videos. They, nothing. I get no commission from anything from buy. I have no affiliation, no partnership with buy i bought that machine with my own money like it wasn't gifted to me or nothing some people are asking if i since i had the machine for a little while do i think that it's a great machine do i refer people to no nope nope so many things that i've experienced within the past couple of months with the machine no i don't I it's not my suggestion to buy it. If you decide to buy it and you have a great experience, you are the chosen one. Um, I haven't had a great experience with it. And some of my videos, like people are asking, like, machine look like it's working fine. It's called <laughs> editing. Um, because I don't believe you guys want to see me constantly stop, cut, stop, cut, stop, cut, stop, cut when it's supposed to be cutting on its own. Um, I, I would click past that video. But there are times where I don't have to stop and cut for the first probably 15 minutes. And that's when I'm lucky. I don't I don't know. But other than that, I'm mostly stopping and cutting the machine myself. So there's something wrong with my cutter. In the buy group, a lot of people are having issues with their machine no longer cutting after um, a few designs. I thought I solved the problem by switching out my bobbin case because the machine keeps eating at my pigtail. Yeah. Ciao. I don't know. Some people had asked me if I received a refund, my refund yet. And then I reached out recently to let him know like, hey, I'm still having the same issues with the machine with the cutter. And I still didn't receive the rest of my refund. Like what's going on? And he's like, oh, that's impossible because it's been months and stuff. Yeah, it's been months, so that's why I'm reaching out to you to figure out what the hell is going on. Like, if I don't take the time to stop constantly working, 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 knocking out these orders, to be honest, I would have never noticed that I, I didn't receive my refund unless somebody asked me and me going back to actually check. I'm like, wait, I, this is more than $2,000 I didn't get back. Like, where's the rest of my money? Like, hello. I'm like, okay, we're in October, almost kissing November. He was just going back and forth with me like, oh, your money was returned. It was a return. And then he was like, oh, um, that's between you and Alibaba. That, like, the customer service is just, is just trash. And then he was like, okay, I'll check. Leave the refund back in my account today on Sunday. But, um, yeah. Do I refer this brand, this company? No. I have work to do as to making the machine perfect. For people to be confident to buy. I was extremely hesitant to buy in the beginning. I didn't know a lot of people who had the machine. I was excited to receive it. And I was excited um, and had very much so high hopes of the machine to, you know, work just as good as the competition. And I was disappointed. I'm still disappointed. I think they have a lot of things to fix customer service wise. They have to a lot of things to fix via machine wise i have my own platform that i want to voice my experience and people come to my platform to see if this is something that they want to potentially buy and i'm going to give people my honest truth like even if it was sponsored or not i'm going to give you 100 percent honesty because i would hate for somebody to buy something off of the strength of my experience and they're like yeah she's a liar bro like this 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 is not what she claimed that it was 
So I'm not going to claim that it's a great machine because I haven't had a great experience with it in the past couple of months. I can say though that um, the functions on the machines is user friendly, like beginner level friendly. It's not hard to work the machine. You just need a machine that actually works the way how it's supposed to. Other than that, if I didn't have the cutting issues and the occasional and why limit error that um, completely stops in the middle of a job, and it says that the design is too big for the screen for for the frame which I know it's not and then it just like I'm in the middle of a project and it's working and it's working and it's working and then it just pauses dead in the middle of the project and it says the access error and then the needle is like right in the middle of the frame it's nowhere near the the, the edges of the frame or nothing because then I have to start the you know shut down the machine turn it back on and find the last spot of where it's stitched because it doesn't automatically go back to it um once you press the okay button um it just shifts the the, the design to a whole another part of the of the frame which is crazy to me i don't know other than that if these issues if these major issues weren't an issue um i think i would have actually loved the machine yeah that's my honest review that's my honest opinion I'm gonna get back to work. You might think I'm crazy, but I'm serious. It's better you know now. But what I thought was happiness was only for darkness. You can take a bow. Guess 
what I got. I'm so excited to get this. I wanted this for a very long time. Since I'm starting to add new things to my shop that I always wanted to do from the very beginning. But I couldn't and didn't have the time to because my outfit's just starting blowing up and I never had an off time. So, the Brother 1034D uh, Serger. This was, I got this from Amazon. I hope it works because usually the machines I get from Amazon comes broken in pieces. I also bought, um, I don't know if it already comes with it, but I bought it anyway. I bought Serger Thread. No, oh, these are the good ones. I just bought standard white because everything I'm going to be serging is freaking white. I got four packs. I don't know how much I paid for this. I want to say between ten and fifteen dollars for all four. The surgery thread different. Yeah, this feels different than regular. Um, yeah. Is this supposed to come?